what's going on nation uk vape here and welcome today we got one that everybody's talking about and we gonna we're gonna see if the hype is real it is the gear rta by ofrf or orf if you want to call it um this is actually the second time i'm shooting this video for this one because the first time my mic was not connect properly so i didn't have any sound so yeah we're gonna reshoot it again 24 mil single coil uh very short uh and very sexy to be honest rta uh from a company that came a bit from nowhere even though there might be a sister company of someone but we talked about that in the end so uh what we're gonna do now we're gonna dive down to run to all of it okay let's dive down okay so here is the box where your ofrf or off rta so primarily made of stainless steel very very short 24 mil diameter on the top 510 drip tip with a nice gear engraving there uh, all the 510s that i have fits very very nice but this one i love it look at that it's kind of weird but extremely comfortable now when you unscrew the top you're gonna have your filling method very big kidney shapes uh, going on in there no problems to um to fill it up and then you know i don't want to go in that's fine then you're gonna have your bubble glass this is actually pvc so plastic it is kind of frosted and it holds 3.5 mls on the bottom you're gonna have airflow control with a stopper on both sides pretty pretty easy to adjust nice restriction no issues while you adjust on one side obviously it's going to be the same on the other on the bottom you're gonna have gear by OFRF or OFF um, nice protruding gold plated pin even though I don't think so you don't want to use this so tiny single coil in a mechanical mod and here we're gonna have the chimney okay you can remove obviously your glass this one is actually PVC like the engraving of gear in one side and OFRF on the other very discreet very very nice machining perfect no issues concave shape going on in there treading everything is good and here we have the deck okay now let me zoom in a bit more a bit better now change a bit of the settings so we have a bit more uh, light into it so here is the deck very very simple um this is my previous build obviously from my, the first video i shoot um it's kind kind of gta style you know as you can see slightly elevate from the bottom you throw your single coil doesn't matter which way you you wrap it uh you're gonna be able to to fit it because i love when they give you the the full screws option um and as you can see it's quite a thick coil but it's still even though it comes out a little bit there it's pretty secure no issues in there it's a three mil diameter coil so uh as you can see fits perfectly there and your airflow is gonna come from the bottom eat your coil and flavor all oh, the flavor uh wicking goes in there in that ports i've been experiencing obviously no um leaking uh no flooding deck no dry hits everything is so good on this one um yeah pretty simple to build i mean you throw your coil doesn't matter which way your legs are they're always gonna fit throw it in there and that's it you're ready to go uh I, i'm not gonna show the build i mean i show in the first video uh but as you can see so simple just throw your coil airflow from the bottom yeah you're good to go so let's throw some cotton so the cotton is in place you always want to give it the comb like i always recommend to keep all that fibers facing the same way here we go you don't need a lot of cotton on this one um, and wicking is pretty simple um, it's not very very hard to get it at the first cut it right about there just on the edge of the deck or the tank itself say cotton in place throw it in there how simple is that actually I throw the other shoelace they send I know that it got a name I just can't remember the name Ling lingots I can't remember the name of those things so I call it just shoelaces it's simple here we 
go. That's it. Look at that. Perfect. Now, obviously, prime it. Oh, yes. It's going to be very, very nice clouds. Give it a pre-fire, you know, just to break down that cotton and give it some power. Attach, obviously, your favorite uh, glass, depending if you want the bubble or the other one. This thing is short. It's so short. So, so nice. Here we go. Fill it up. 3.5 ml on the bubble glass. Nothing complicated. As you can see, pretty easy to build, uh, pretty easy to wick, and the flavor. Oh yes, we're gonna talk about that. So, uh, we ready? We're gonna come back on top, tell you where you can get it, price, and we run to pros and cons. All right, and we're back, and that was the up and close for the gear by OFRF. So where you can get it and price. Can I get a fast tech for $39.90? 35, 34 UK pounds. Yeah, it's still a bit expensive, this one. Um, I think it's just because of the hype of it. Uh, you can get stainless steel, black, gold, and rainbow. Uh, what else I want to say? And yes, and the price is $39.99 for all of them. So, pros and cons. <laughs> the cons were very hard for this one. Now, the only subjective con that I can throw at this, and uh, honestly, I've been pushing to, to find cons on this one, it is that the amount of liquid that you're going to be able to fit is not going to be a lot. But remember, this is so short, so sexy. That's why you're going to lose juice capacity. Uh, I mean, if you had a taller tank, but it's going to be very high, uh, you're probably going to fit uh, a bit more. But for single coils, if you're using the bubble glass, 3.5 ml is not bad. It's definitely not bad. Um, other than that, I can't, I, I can't find anything else. I mean, um, let's start f for cons, uh, for pros. First of all, all the extras they give you. They give you cotton, they give you coils. Extra 510 pin, I even don't know why. Extra 510 drip tip, uh, extra straight glass, o rings, flat head screws. I mean, you've got everything you need to get started. You just need liquid. <laughs> so, yeah, you get a lot. Machining is perfect. Uh, I love this drip tip. The design of this drip tip is just wonderful. I love it. You know, it does that, I don't know, conical shape. It's, it's very comfortable. Very, very nice to put your lips on. I like the gear on the top, the engraving on the barrel, very simplistic, no issues in there. Very smooth airflow, easy to wick, easy to build. Flavor, flavor is over the top. Uh, you know, I always mention my Kylin uh, Mini for single coil, how I love this flavor. Well, I think it's time. Yeah, it's time that the Kylin calm down for number one because this, this is going to be my number one out here single coil for flavor. It is amazing. It is short. It is sexy. And the flavor. Oh, whoa, oh, oh. whoa. And you don't need a lot of power. I mean, I have a 0.19 build that you saw the one uh, I put on the up and close. 35 watts. Airflow wide open. Let's have a tip. You have vapor production and you have flavor for days very very nice definitely recommend uh, let's talk about um OFRFB a sister company of Watofo now um I'm not sure if they are or not why I know that they, they they I think they send a, um, a text to some reviewer they mentioned in the vape team uh, live uh, live stream that they do every Thursday night um that they were not uh, that they have nothing to do with what offer even though they were on the same building and apparently that building holds a lot of other companies they were on the same building and they have a, a, a wonderful relationship with what offer so that's why maybe maybe they have very similar things maybe what offer made the bags for them you know made the coils for them and they just designed the, the 
the, the RTA. I also know that OFRF does mesh for the profile uh, uh, RDA by, by Wotofo. So they might be just friends. They might be involved in some way. I don't know. Uh, far as OFRF say or Wotofo say, they say they have a very good relationship, but they are completely different companies. If that is true or not, I don't know. Why do I know is that OFRF released a hell of the RDA for RTA for the first RTA they released damn this thing is good I can't wait for the next project that they're gonna release so yeah we're gonna wrap it up uh hope you like it and enjoy it don't forget to like and subscribe to this video uh I wish you all the best and hope to see you next time till there keep vaping